Good morning to all of you. I am very happy to talk to the participants, the students and all the experts present uh, at this event called Media Moguls. I am very happy to know that this event is being organized by uh, MDI Moshidabad. Now of course uh, MDI is a well known brand across India and across the world and I am very happy and I congratulate all of you for being associated with this brand. I have been told that uh, the event Media Mughal essentially uh, takes care of real life uh, problems which are faced by the corporate world, social world and public in general related to issues such as branding, online marketing and marketing, sales management and other such management principles. Now, when I am thinking about an event which is related to branding, I am reminded of something very different. I am reminded of a concept which uh, Dr. Kalam taught me, which was called individual marketing, individual branding. I will explain to you what it means. Way back in 2012, in the month of September, we went to the uh, Lal Bahadur Shastri National Academy. Now, as all of you know, uh, the uh, LBSNAA, which is Lal Bahadur Shastri National Academy, is the training institute for all young IS officers located in Missouri. Of course, it was a very cold day. And when Dr. Kalam uh, started his lecture at around 10 a.m. in the morning, we had a bunch of about 120, 30 odd young IS officers who had just qualified the exams and were going through training. So they would be between 20 to 25 years of age in general. Dr. Kalam completed his lecture. And during the lecture, he gave an oath. And that oath was, I will work with integrity and succeed with integrity. I will work with integrity and succeed with integrity. Everybody took the oath. Of course, if the president is giving you the oath, you take that oath. However, after the uh, lecture was over, the oath was done, the question and answers were opened up. So there were about half an hour of question answering which Dr. Kalam used to take. And then of course there were some of these set questions who were already carrying uh, things written down on paper. You know, fixed questions. So Dr. Kalam said, no, I don't want these fixed questions. I want the questions from, the, from, the, from behind the hall, you know, the, the back rows, the back benches should ask me. Because those are the real questions. When this happened, there was this lady, an IS officer. She raised her hand and she asked. Sir, tell me something, if I become an IS, if, when I get posted as an IS officer and my senior says, you do corruption, you compromise your integrity, you do corruption, if my political boss says do corruption and if I don't do it, they will, they will give me a negative uh, career reference, they may even suspend me, what do I do? So then Dr. Kalam replied, I also was shocked at the question, I was also waiting for the reply. And Dr. Klang thought for about 30 seconds and then he replied. He said, look young lady, I'll tell you one thing. I have spent about five decades of career in government. Whether it is ISRO, whether it is DRDO, whether it is uh, the nuclear project, whether it is hovercraft, whether it is uh, light combat aircraft or even the Rashtrapati Bhavan. And I have served with all kinds of bosses, political bosses, bureaucratic bosses, uh, technocratic process, some of them had great reputation, some of them did not have great reputation. But he said, at no point in my career, at no point did anyone ask me, any of his bosses ask me that, can he do something wrong? Can you sign there and give favors to someone? Can he do some corruption? He said, nobody even asked me. Now this was surprising. So he continued. He said, you know why this happened? This happened because I built a brand of excellence and integrity. I built a brand of excellence and integrity. So that is what is important, my friends. Today you are talking about branding for corporate world. Today you are talking about branding for some products. But what about the branding for yourself? So you are all young boys and girls. Today I ask you the question, which emanated from Dr. Kalam way back in 2012. What is your brand? What is that you want to be remembered for? When you grow old, what will you remember yourself for? One change, one brand, one idea, one value, one thing which you will always do, 
and one thing which you will never do. These identity parameters will define who you are. And today, sitting here, when you go back home, when you go back to your hostel, take a sheet of paper, write your brand, write one para on your brand, a thing which you want to be remembered for. That one page will be your page in the history of humankind. And that one page will guide you through so many decisions when you go ahead in your professional life. So I once again congratulate MDI Murshidabad for organizing this fabulous event. I, uh, my best wishes to all the participants, all the delegates that you have competitions, all the participants of those competitions, all the faculty and everybody else who is present there. I wish I was with you but sometimes uh, logistics do not allow that. But thankfully we have an electronic world where I am with you despite not being physically there. Namaskar.